Hey you guys, it's your girl Classy Queen. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. If you're oldie, welcome back. So I'm just going to share my weekend with you guys. So let's just hop into it. Um, I'm not really sure what I'm going to be doing today right now. I'm about to pack me up some turkey burgers. I have some uh, meat that I'm about to pet up and I'm going to put it in the oven. But yeah, I just want to get out the house for a minute. I'm probably going to go to Walmart. As you can see, I washed my hair last night, so I'm be wearing my real hair for about a week. My hair is so thick. And you guys, when I say it took me an hour to wash my hair, it literally took me a whole hour just to wash my hair. So I'm trying to find a good conditioner. If you guys know any good conditioners for natural hair, please leave it down below because the detangle is real. Like I'm telling you, detangling my hair, it ain't no joke. It really ain't no joke. But yeah, I'm about to pack these burgers up and I'm gonna cook them in the oven. So I wanna do that before I head out the door. I'm gonna season it. But as bad as I wanna go to Target, I'm just gonna go to Walmart because it's right down the street. Um, I don't wanna do too much today because my chest is kinda hurting me. So I just need to get out and get some fresh air. So, yeah, I'm about to pack these burgers up. And then I'm going to Walmart and I probably run into DD's. But, yeah, I'll see you guys in a little while. Let me go ahead, wash my face, brush my teeth. I did just get out the bed. Um, but, yeah, see you in a minute. He's begging me for the treat, begging me. He throw a feel when I leave him. He like, hey, let me run, let me run. Yeah. It is raining out here. That's why I slept all freaking morning. Cause it's raining. I ain't had no breakfast. I don't know why this is the last week. I'm wiping on this mad stuff. Probably cause I had it in the car and it was hot. I guess it's busted. I don't know. But yeah. Yeah, my skin looks so good. It's really clearing up like I still got a little darkness that I need to take care of. Y'all know I've been using that um, Murad. I started using it after my facial that I got. And it really have been working, really. Like, these little breakouts, they almost gone. Well, the ones that I had, they're gone. And some new ones popped up. So, it's like two on this side and a few over here. But I just have to work on these dark spots. But I can say they have tremendously brighten like really okay I hope I get my umbrella oh yeah got my umbrella because it is rainy every time it rain y'all every time it rain I oversleep that's that good weather if you at home why can't bag out I'm about to run into my bush. I got my burgers in the oven. I'm making me some turkey burgers. I know my husband looking at the camera. He probably finna call me. What is you doing? You forgot how to drive? I guess I'm still sleeping. I need to get it together though. So I'm on this road. I'm gonna get it together though. But yeah, I got my turkey burgers in the oven. I'm going to pick me up some French. I think I got some French fries. But I'm about to go to Walmart. I really want to go to Target, but I don't know. I don't feel like driving all the way out there. I mean, it's not far. It's like 15 minutes, but Walmart right down the street. So I'm about to go to Walmart. I got my coffee. I've been drinking cold coffee. Lately, I mean, I broke my coffee pot. Well, I didn't break it, but it broke. It just stopped working. So, but that's a good thing because it's not cold anymore. It's warming up. So, I just been drinking cold coffee. And I've been getting that Starbucks coffee um, from Walmart. Not from Walmart. I've been getting that um, Starbucks coffee from, uh, what? Kroger's. 
Well, I'm sure they got it at Walmart anyway, but it's the um, Starbucks vanilla kind. So yeah, I've been drinking it and I mix it with some vanilla milk. Oh my God, it be so good. It's popping, just put a little bit of ice in here. Mm. I ain't even had breakfast yet. Like, it's literally 11 o'clock. And I'm just gonna eat me some little bites. Y'all, these are here so fire, but I'm upset with they ass because they only put four in here. Four, what I'm doing? This not tease me. Four? They're so freaking good, y'all. I'm about to email them and tell them they need to do better than this. It's just some little mini muffins. Look just like that. They got different kinds. This is the blueberry muffin. They also have birthday cake, strawberry. I think, the, yeah, chocolate chip, that one good. That's what made me really start liking them, the chocolate chip ones. I think they got a raisin one. I don't like raisin. Oh, yeah. This is my breakfast. And when I get back home, hopefully my burger be done. Hopefully my husband will make my fries too. My boy still asleep. I'm not sure what they want to eat, but just the lunchtime, they'll eat like a hot pocket with some mozzarella sticks or something like that. Let me put my perfume on. I got three lip gloss in my purse. I just feel incomplete if I don't have my lip gloss. Like, literally. I feel so incomplete without this lip gloss. I was like, I hate when people just pull up next to y'all and just be looking. The fuck you looking at? Looking at ass nigga. But yeah, this is the perfume that I'm wearing today. It's tease, vibrate. From Victoria's Secret. And we match my shirt too. But yeah, that's my vibe for today. Some light. So, got that in my purse. I don't know where my chest is hurting. I'm pick up me some gay. I got some at home. Why is my chest hurting? I don't know. I'm gonna pick up me some gas. I think I do got some. Yeah, I do got some. I should have took one before I left. But I like woke up, my chest was hurting real bad. I watched a little bit of news and then I went back to sleep. It's raining out here. Why is there so much, so many people out here? Where is everybody gone? Going? Where well, it is lunchtime? It's 11:20. What this is she? Bitch, you got to go back to make me go. And why you drive with your mask on? It's only you in the car. What the? Child, I already can't breathe when I wear my mask. And this motherfucker here got her mask on, and it's just her in the car. Baby, when I get halfway to my car, I'm taking my mask off so I can breathe. If it's like not too many people around. But if it is, but if it is, I'm going to take it off as soon as I get in the car. But yeah, this is my hair. It's no sun out here. I don't know why I got these shades. I got it on because I'm just basic today. I ain't got on no um, concealer under my eyes. I ain't do my eyebrows. I'm just basic, natural hair. But yeah, y'all need to let me know some good conditioner. It literally took me an hour to wash my hair last night. A whole freaking hour. Like, I was in the shower. Well, not really washing my hair, but I was in the shower for a whole hour. And I had to wash my hair. That what took up most of my shower time. I'm trying to wash my hair detangling. And I tried, like, three different products. I even tried my, um, Garnier, I used to love, love, love that conditioner because they had good slip. I don't know if they changed the product in there or what, but mm-mm. Mm-mm. It ain't working. So I'm about to go to Walmart and pick up a couple of conditioners to try on my hair. Because I do want to try to start wearing my hair out more. I said I was going to put a bun in, but I ain't feel like I'm just going to keep these braids in. I'm going to wear these braids for like a week. And probably next week, I'm going to wear a bun. That's what I'm going to do. 
because it's hurt. It, it's so thick, y'all. But I did put a, a texturizer in my hair. I put a texturizer in my hair probably, uh, it been about two years. I put a texturizer in my hair and I regretted it then. I still regret it because the ends of my hair, they're a little straighter. And, you know, of course, my roots thick. Somebody had a freaking wreck. That's why y'all need to slow down in the rain. Y'all gonna get there? Just slow down. If you're going to work, then fuck them. You would get there, baby. Now you on a stretcher. Because you trying to rush to work. Baby, get there when you get there. They will be okay. <laughs> That's my mode, y'all. I'll be late. <sighs> They be like, why you late? You always late. I ain't always late. It just be a free minutes. But if it's a lot of traffic, I have to take the expressway to work. And if it's a lot of traffic, I ain't going to be rushing. I'm going to take my time. Right? If it's early in the morning, I'm going to take my time. I'm not rushing nowhere. And I'm not finna wake up early. I'm going to wake up at the same time every day. And I'm going to get there when I get there. But it is some day where I make it there early. Like if it's on the weekend or something where everybody, I got to be at work early, early in the morning. So on the weekend, no traffic, babe. I be sliding on the blade. Sliding on the blade, honey. There ain't be nobody on the E-way. Well, y'all let me know in the comments if you have natural hair, what conditioner do you use? to detangle your hair because maybe this ain't gonna work usually i just braid my hair down my daughter braided my hair i love how she braided my hair but that was in smaller braids and when i took them down i think i wore my hair like for two days with just a head on to work and i didn't detangle so i just hopped in the shower last night and it was just it's just, it was a whole process a whole freaking process but yeah, I'm just gonna usually when I braid my hair, I just do about four or five big braids and throw my wig on. But honey, don't go braids. Woo, child. My arm still hurt. They still hurt. I hope they ain't crowded in here. I don't really like going to Walmart no more. It's like a clown shop or something. I don't know. Something always going on. Somebody always in your bed. Somebody always looking at you. Like, what? Shop? Did you come here to shop? Go shop. Leave it alone. I just want to be in and out. And it just be so many people at Walmart now. Like, oh my God. That's why I don't like vlogging when I'm in the store. Because people always looking. What? Looking at this nigga. <sighs> but yeah, I'm about to run in here. Pick up me some products. And I may pick up dinner for tomorrow. I know I'm going to do some meatballs. Oh, I need to give me some sauce for my meatballs. That's what I'm doing today. Give me some meatballs and some little pasta. Tomorrow I'm going to do um, this crock pot thing. So I need to pick up dinner for tomorrow. And it is crowded. Oh, my God. It be too many people. I don't like lines. I'm so impatient. So when I go in the store, I be wanting to go in there, get what I need to get, and be out of there. Like deuces and now that I'm thinking about it I gotta go to DD's too I should've went to DD's because I gotta get groceries in here and I want my food to be sitting in the car I ain't gonna be that long though DD's right down the street too that's why I love my neighborhood because it's like everything is like right down the street from me I have a um, Walmart I'm looking at my favorite Panda Express. I need to go over there and give me some. Nah, I'm cooking. I ain't gonna go over there. Um, then we have a lot of restaurants over here. Everything's just right down the street. But to be honest, I love to live in the country. All right, y'all. So I'm back in the car. Let me show y'all what I got. What conditioner I got? I got groceries also. I'm not sure about it. But I'm making me a pot roast tomorrow. Alcohol. And this is the detangler that I get. It's a um, give me slip blast hydration conditioner. So if y'all, any of y'all try this, let me know how you like it. I just saw give me slip, and I'm, I'm just hoping 
that it works. And this one here is a um, Pantene brand. It's a moisture boost conditioner. And first, we're argan oil, moisturize and detangle hair for instant softness and strength. So I saw detangle hair and I pick it up. Oh, wow, Pantene, I made something for natural hair. Is this old? I'm just not saying this. But yeah, those are two that I picked up. I'm always going on a t-shirt app. So I did pick up two more t-shirts. This color here. It just around it. I got it in that color. And I'm probably not gonna wear this for the summertime. I don't know, probably is. Yeah. This just this V-neck olive green color. It's looking gray on camera, but it's olive green. But that blue is pretty. That one made me go with it. I found that blue is real pretty. And I got the tennis shoes that go with it. And I just got me another bunny. This one here, it got the wide um, edge, what you call it? Wide edge bunny. Yeah, but it's thick, so when I do my edges, I put my, um, hit my scarf on, and then I put that bunny on top of it, so in the more time, I won't have to do my edges. Yeah, I can do them at night time. Why am I coffee going on? Oh, I gotta eat. These folks park so stupid. Why don't you park so close to me? Uh, I know my air probably be a little loud, but I'm hot, y'all. It's hot. Let me sweating. I usually, when I first went natural, they used to make this olive oil conditioner. Uh, it's a repurbished conditioner. When I say that junk was good, sis, that was some good conditioner. But I can't find it anymore. I went on Amazon and I found it on there, but it's so freaking high, so yeah, I'm not gonna I ain't gonna pay that much for a conditioner, so I don't know. I just have to find something else. But what I was using on my hair yesterday is these real big bottles that I got from Marshalls. It's one got biotin in it, which it is good for my hair. It don't have sulfate in it, so it do not lather. It do not lather like I want it to. And the conditioner, it's real light too, and it, it don't, it's not giving what it needs to give. Like, I don't know. It's good though. So I tried to mix it with my, um, what is it called? The one in the green, but I can't think of the night one right there. But I mixed it with that shampoo conditioner and that will really detangle my hair. But I wanna go through all that. I use like half the bottle. <sighs> my wife like this. Yeah, look at this. They put a five below down the street by my house. And it's right next to Diddy's. Yeah, I love five and below. Me and my boys always come here. Not to this one, but um, we go to the one in Olive Branch. But they love Five and Below. They're going to be excited. Because now they're going to be like, Mom, can we go to Five and Below? I'm like, sure can. It's right down the street. So I'm back in the car from Diddy's. I'm show you guys what I got real quick. Let me crack this cup. It's hot. Got my nails so busted today. Alright. <laughs> I'm just natural away, baby. Got my real hair going today. Did I show you guys my I went to the mall and got me a uh, new piercing. If y'all know me, I do love piercings. I do have a lot of holes. Two of them, I don't have an earring in it, but this. And you know, I got my nose pierced. Um, yeah, but it's starting to heal. I've been wanting the industrial for a while. So I finally got it. Finally got it. I want to get a snake bite on my tongue, but I don't know. That may be doing too much. 
don't know, but I'm gonna show you guys what I got from I feel so good today. I don't know why I'm so comfortable. I just got on my t-shirt, these little stretch pants, and my slide-in vans. Well, they not slide-ins. They're like, I don't know what they call it, like loafers or something. Yeah, I got those. Um, this the lotion I keep in my car, you guys. It's the Midnight Swim. Put some in there. I try to always put lotion on after I sanitize because my hands just be cracking up so freaking bad. I need to keep some oil in my that's what I need to do. So thirsty. Man, she was balling up in that pocket spot. Like somebody was trying to race her. But yeah, let's see what I spent. I spent $36. But that I watch, uh, Janine Jenkins, I think her name. But I love her vlogs. I'm gonna put her, uh, I'm gonna put her name somewhere on the screen. But I just love her vlogs. I watch a lot of vlogs. But she always talked about these stretch pants that she get from DDs, and they're very affordable. My daughter actually used to work for DDs um, a while ago, like when they first came to Memphis. But I used to go in there all the time. Not all the time, but I did go in there and shop and give me like summer dresses and things like that. And they have cute little household stuff too. But I went in there today, baby. I think I'm coming back because they got some cute little shorts. I, I don't really just wear shorts like that unless they stretchy shorts. I probably got about four or five pairs of jean shorts. But I love to be comfortable. You know, you know. But she always talk about this these American apparel. Obviously, a lot of people watch her videos because I only could find one. They're very stretchy. Uh, and that was only $4.99. And they high waisted. So I did get in the brown pair because this the only color that they had had in my size. But I love that they're high waist and they're tight. And it's tight at the bottom. And looking at them, it look like it'll go down to my ankles. Right in my ankles. I am sure sometimes when I wear tights, they kind of bunch up. At my ankle, I don't like that. I just like them to be just straight. But yeah, I got them in this brown pair. But I'm going to keep checking back because I want them in every color. And I also picked up these pants here, which a lot of people have. Um, this brand is Odos, and they were $6.99, I believe. I know it was a price on here. I don't know, what a price for. Let me look at my receipt. They were $8.99. That was either $8.99 or $6.99, but I believe that was $8.99. Yeah, that was $8.99. But yeah, it's just these stretchy pants. And they kind of like rouge up at the um, back part on your butt. Make it look like you got some booty because I ain't got none. But I love me some stretch pants. I love stretch pants because they're so comfortable. So they, okay, yeah, they were $8.99, because these here were $6.99, and these are like joggers, not joggers, but like workout pants, and I love, I got these because they have pockets on them, and I love to go walking in the park, and I love that they have pockets on them, and I can just stick my phone, you know, in there, and it looks the teak. Stretchy, straight leg at the bottom. I love it. And the material just feels so freaking good. Who make things? The fit is lit. <laughs> lit 26. This the brand. So freaking comfortable. I used to always go to um, either Burlington or Ross to get me some stretch pants. Oh, and I got one more pair. 
These are shorts. Fila. $11.99 for Fila. And it gives high waisted shorts and it has Fila on the side. You see? Yeah. Fila on the side of the shorts. This very good material, too. $11.99. So I got me four pair of bottles for $36. That's good. That's hella good. But yeah, I went, oh, here got a tag. It was $8.99. But I hope everything fit well, so I won't have to come back. If they do fit well, I will be coming back and give me uh, a couple more per of those leggings. And sometime about the lit. When I say lit, I mean hot as hell. Something about to be hot, baby. So I'm going uh, How you gonna bag out when I bag out? Come on, baby. Come on. Do what you're gonna do. Yeah, but it's gonna be so hot and I just like to wear a thin layer of clothes. So I just got me those tights. And I got me a couple of t-shirts. I got a whole lot of um, summer dresses. I don't think I'm gonna buy no summer dresses this summer. At least that's what I say. What you stop for like you finna turn in here? I don't even know how these people. It feel like it about to stop pouring down right. Oh, I hope my husband check my burgers. I need to call him. But yeah, I'm about to head to the house. Um, probably find me something on Netflix to watch and just chill for the rest of the day. Um, last time I'm cooking burgers right now, burgers and fries. I don't really eat ground beef, so I'm making these turkey burgers. And I did pick up some more ground beef for my boys because they like um, ground beef better than turkey. They don't even like the turkey bacon that I cook. They say it tastes like plastic, but it's good to me. So I'm going to make them some um, bacon and I did pick up them some onion rings. So, not bacon. What? Make them a uh, um, beef burger with some onion rings. And we just going to chill. And later on today, I'm going to cook me some um, meatballs and you know, pasta. Yeah. So I just see you guys later. All right, you guys. So I'm back at home. I got my little bunny on. It's so cute. I love me some pink. But I'm going to show you guys my burger because it looks so freaking good. Yeah, I look at this. So this is my turkey burger. I got my lettuce, mayo, mustard, and I just put all type of seasoning on. I know it's good. And I air fried me some fries. This is the uh, sauce that I cooked it with that. And I put a little Worcestershire sauce on it. Worcestershire? Yeah, that. Put some net on there. This one I'm cooking tonight with my meatballs. But yeah, I with my turkey burgers, I always just pat it up, season it, put it in full um, in a glass pan, put this top on it. I actually got two of those. I don't know why. But yeah, I'm gonna eat that. And my boys, they love mozzarella sticks and onion rings. So air fry is the best thing that they could have came up with. I love this thing. I really, really love this. This was a gift from my granny. But yeah, they about to eat their mozzarella sticks and onion rings. And I'm finna have my target break. Hey y'all. So this the next day and I just got a little shopping to do. So you know I'ma take y'all with me. I'ma take y'all with me. I'm trying to put this earring in my ear. I'm always losing these. Well, not always. It just, they don't last long. They turn color, so I have to change them out as soon as they turn color. It's just a little baby studs. These are what I put in my holes. These here, the studs. You can see them. Little baby studs. Yeah, this is what I put in my ear. I love piercings, if y'all don't know already. And I'm probably gonna take this one now. I wanted to get another hoop, but it's starting to change colors. As you can see, it was silver, now it's like turnish. So, 
Yeah, I'm gonna put the other stud at the top. This is like a car get ready with me. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna put that at the top. Turn this air down. Yeah, I probably can't even hear me. Yeah, yeah. It's been rainy. I just left um, my kids' doctor appointment. They had an appointment today, so we just left there. Of course, they're not in the car with me now. They're at home. I just stopped and got those KFC and dropped them off. Nice mommy time. But yeah, I had just picked up some lashes also from my beauty supply store. I'm not sure which ones I want to wear. I got this style here and this style. What I feel like today, I think I'm gonna put on these. Yes, I'm gonna put them on right here in the car. Right here. Cause I feel bald head. You see? I'm bald head. My plaid coming down. I'm trying to give my wigs a break and just let my hair air out some, so I've been wearing my real hair. This only the second day, but I'm finna be wearing it out. This is back up. I don't know why this plaid won't stay. My sister did my nails. It's this pretty pink color. Oh, it's so pretty. Let me get this head on, y'all. I'm gonna take it off. My hair's so thick, honey, it's thick. But my bald head ass eyes need some money. I wish I had some scissors. They seem to be a little bit too long. But I'm gonna make it work. I'm gonna make it work. I used a duo. It's the lash glue that I use. This purse that I want at Burlington, so I'm about to not Burlington but Marshalls. So I'm about to go back to Marshalls and see who they have it. It's like a black purse with a little chain on a gold or silver chain. I think it had a gold chain on. I do have a bigger version of it, but I want something smaller. I feel like I need a backpack. If I can find me a backpack purse, I'm gonna give me a backpack purse because I'm gonna take my boys to this thing part tomorrow. Why well, I'm about to put on these shades and I'm gonna do my lashes. Yeah. Some another thing that I got out of my breeze for last store is this um lip gloss. Y'all know I love me some lip gloss. So my favorite brand is NK, Nikki K. And I got the uh mint and I got the mango. It's just a lip gel. These some pretty pretty colors. I love they lip gloss, it lasts for a long time like this. I put this on. 30 minutes ago I think 30 minutes ago right after I ate some chicken I went to check um, KFC I ate some chicken put this on a different one I don't know where it's at I think I took it in the house I put this one on this here is the um, bubble gum it's almost gone but that's this the one that I put on 
So I want to try this mint one out. I saw it and I'm like, oh, these some cute colors. So me, I had the every time I go in the boost supply store, I'm always picking up lip gloss. I want to smell them. It's this mint smell, like mint smell them. Oh, I should have put this one on. It don't hurt to put a little bit more. My husband hate when I put lip gloss on. Every time I'm like, baby, give me a kiss. He, <laughs> he won't kiss me on the lips when I have lip gloss on. Because he had his lips shining. He don't like that. But yeah. I, I, can, I really can't wait till my face clear up. This person. Who got out of this car? But these lashes look good. Y'all like them? Y'all like these lashes? Yeah. But anyway, I'm about to run into uh, Marshalls. I'll talk to you guys when I get in Marshalls. Okay, I'm in Marshalls now. I ordered this thing off Amazon. Because I saw it on TV. But I needed a new, um, what you call it? Sun visor? I think that's what it's called, sun visor. You know that you put on on your car, the window of your car, to block the sun out. So it's made like an umbrella. So I'm about to put this on here. Look this man got beads in his head. Ooh, bead kids these days. So yeah, I'm about to put this on here. Hold on. Okay, so this is what it look like. It's made just like a umbrella. See? Just like an umbrella. Neat. But yeah, that's just gonna, um, it had my car so freaking cool. When I get back in my car, it just had it so freaking cool. Let me close this up. Because it's getting so freaking hot. And I got leather seats. And y'all know, if you got leather seats, you know, you, you can't even wear shorts. Because baby, at that time, you bring them seats up. And you get in here with some shorts on, they'll bring your ass up. But yeah, I'm about to run in marshes and find something real quick. I'm going to put this hat back on because her head thick. All right, y'all. So I'm back in the freaking car. Oh, it's hot. It's hot in there. That was a fail. That was a fail. Marshall's ain't got nothing. Nothing in there. Oh, my God. I know I should have got that bag when I saw I do that every time. Every freaking time I see a bag I want and I be like, eh, I ain't coming here for this. I'm just finna get this and I'ma come back after I think about it. And I thought about it and I was like, ooh, I should've got the bag. Come back, it's gone. <sighs> so that was the sale and they really didn't have no cute backpacks in there. I look for a backpack purse. So I'm probably gonna use the one that I got at home, but I just got me a pedicure um, thing here. And I did pick up some sports bras. They do have very good sports bras. I get a lot of my bras from there. Oh, also got me some Fowlers. And these bras, ain't these bras so cute? They look like little t-shirts. So freaking cute. I hope y'all can see. I need to take this thing off my window. But it's two of them. It's a pink. And it's a gray one. And the brand is Lucky Bond. And then I got this Vince Comuto. This here reminds me of Skims. It just feels so freaking soft. This is something that I'll probably put on with my sundresses or something. Because it's like very thin material like Skims. Very flexible and it just look like it's so comfortable. And they got Vince Camuto at the bottom here. You can see. But yeah, at the bottom here it says Vince. Vince Camuto. Is it on the other one? Yeah. It's on here also. But they cute. Cute. I found something, but I'm about to go to Burlington now. Let me take this out of my window. I like this umbrella, but big for my car. But my car cool. 
it wasn't hot when I got it here, but I, yeah, I think it's too big for my car. So I'm probably gonna give it to my husband and give me a small one. Hey y'all, okay, so I'm back at home. Um, oh, this hair looks so crazy, it's so puffy. I don't know, but I got some, I'm taking my boys out tomorrow and we're gonna be at the theme park. So I'm probably gonna grease my scalp tonight and just wear a bun tomorrow. That's what I'm doing, I'm wearing my bun. But let me show you guys what I got from the store. From, um, I went to Ulta and Burlington. So, I did got to go to Burlington. My guy. Put some lip gloss. So I'm just loving these lip gloss, you guys. If y'all ain't tried to go to your beauty supply store and get you some. That's so freaking good. Oh, and it smells so yummy. It smells so yummy. But yeah, I found these chapsticks here i got from burlington i believe it was five dollars yeah it was five dollars from burlington and it's all different flavors let me open it i see you got mango punch and something else let me see let me open it but y'all see what the brand is meet the k look at that so I bought these because I love to put chapstick on at nighttime. So my lips won't be too sticky. I put these chapsticks on at night. So we got Berry Mash, Palm Punch. I'm so excited. I get excited about little things. Mango Tanger. Tang Tango. Mango Tango. Coconut, which I'm probably gonna get this to one of my boys. I mean, it's just chapstick. And the last one is citrus pink. I'm going to smell this. I shouldn't put that lip gloss on. Oh, it smells so good. Yep. I think I'm going to like these. But yeah, you get five of them. You get five of them for um $5. So like a dollar a piece. So I'm be trying these out. If I like them, I'm gonna go back and pick up a couple more packages. Uh, then I got some masks. I got these face masks. I love doing face masks. K Beauty Glow Skin Face Mask. It got the honey, anti-aging, pearl, nourishing rice, which that's new. I never tried that before, so I'm interested in seeing, you know, what that about. Got vitamin C and brightening aloe. So, yeah, I got that. I went in there to find this oil because I needed some more oil for my hair. So, I did pick this one up. And this is a different one. It's um, Jamaican Black Castor Oil. It boosts hair growth and strength. This, this oil lasts a long time. Long time. Very good. Very affordable. It's just... $4.99 at Marshalls. And I got some sunscreen for my boys. Um, I got the lotion kind, but I rather for them to use the spray instead of the lotion. So I just picked this up. It's like a spray lotion. And it is uh, SPF 30. So I picked that up. Um, I already showed you guys what I got from Marsha's, just some bras and stuff, but I also got this perfume. I don't hear too many people talking about it, but I don't know. Y'all know I went to Marsha's and I found that bra set. Let me show you guys again because I don't think you saw the um, the name on the bottom. Let's see if you can see it now. You see? Vince Camuto. And it's on both of them. And I just love this material. It's very thin. And it just feels so comfy. So, since I bought those and I saw this perfume, I decided to buy it. So, I'm going to open it and smell it. Let's see what she talking about. Y'all yeah, probably hear my boys in the background. They playing that game, so. They just always hollering when they on the game. But, yeah. Let's see. I don't know what's in here. I don't know. 
The bottle is cute though. Ain't this so cute? It kind of remind me of Juicy Couture. Look at that. Oh my God. Okay. Let's see. Come off like that. The important thing is the sprayer. Let's see how it spray. Okay. She actually smell good. I'm gonna let it sit on there. It's very light though. It smells springy. I'm gonna spray it on my skin. When I first spray, it's kind of giving me alcohol, the alcohol smell. But it smells a little fruity. So I'm gonna um, let it sit on my skin for a while and just see what the dry down is. So that's everything from Burlington. Then I went to Uphill. So I usually I get these um, tree hut scrubs from Walmart. I usually get them from Walmart, but they're always out of it. So when I went on Amazon, they was just overpriced. So I was like, I'm just going to wait. Then I found out that Target sell those. But every time I go to Target, the shelves be bare. Like people buy them so quick. So when I went into Ulta, which I'm going to show you guys what I went in there for. They had this sitting on the end cap. I was like, oh, let me go ahead and get this because I've been waiting to try it. Yeah, I think I paid $10 for this. $10. Then I ended up going to Target. Yes, I went back to Target. I went to Target today. And I, um, what did I get from Target? I don't even remember. I'll show you guys. I, I went grocery shopping, yeah. Um, I went to Target and then they had these same ones on the end cap for six dollars, six dollars and some change. So it's there's like a four dollar difference. I might may take this back to Ulta and go back to Target and get it. I don't know, but I've been waiting on this, so I did get two of these. I went into Ulta to get. This because you guys know I've been cleansing my face with the Murad, which have been working, but I'm trying to get rid of uh, these dark spots. You can't see them that much, probably. I got still got a little makeup on, but yeah, this here, this thing here was like thirty dollars, I believe. Let me see. This little bit of bottle. Twenty three dollars. Oh, okay, it wasn't that bad. I thought it was th still expensive for this little bottle, but it was like $23. The big one, when I first went, they had a big one. It was like $70 for a real big box. And I was debating on do I want it or not, but after using the face wash, I really like the face wash. So I'm like, if that worked, then I know I'm going to go ahead and pick up the spot treatment. So I went back in there today. They didn't have the big ones, but they did have the small ones. Look at this little tube, y'all. So I'm not gonna be able to like moisturize my whole face with it. It is just a spot treatment. So I'm just gonna take little bits of it. Like I wanna show y'all, but <laughs> I don't wanna waste nothing like that. See, that's what it look like. But this little tube was $23. So I'm probably about to wash my face and go ahead and put this, start using this, put this on my face. But yeah, that's what I went into up the up to four. But I ended up seeing these sugar scrubs, and this is the cotton candy. Smells so good. Yeah, I ended up going on the perfume aisle. Who told me to go on the perfume aisle? So that's what I ended up picking up. I've been wanting this perfume so long, but I kind of went on a no perfume buy for a while. So. I just had to get it. I just had to treat myself. I've been working so hard and like been exhausted. So I just had, had to have a myself day out and I, I deserve this. So I went on and got it. It's only, I think I got the 1.6. Yeah, it's a 1.6 ounce. That's what the box look like. I hope I like this because some of Mark Jacobs perfume, like the um, Decadence, I believe it is. I don't really like that. 
but they don't really last as long. I love that he creative with his bottles, but the scent really don't last that long. You have to really spray it. But this is what the bottle look like. I feel like I'm finna run through this so fast. I did smell it while I was in there. I did smell it. And I do love the smell. Just look at this. It got a little hell on it. Kittens, cherries, a big blue bow, dice, bananas. You know, just, it's he's so creative when it comes to his perfume. Can I see? Okay, now the dry down on this here smells good. The dry down do smell good. Like I said, when you first spread, it smell like alcohol. But the dry down is good. It is a light scent. Sweet and light. So, you probably have to spray a lot of it. So, this here, I probably will wear like when I'm just running errands or something. I probably won't worry that on the date or anything. But, when I'm running errands. But, the bottle is pretty. But, let's get back to this bottle. The cap, the bottle. And I'm spraying it on the back of my arm. I already smelled it. I don't know why I'm spraying it again. <sighs> perfect. This is the right name for this perfect. But I got to find out if it lasts a long time. How long do it last? Oh my God, y'all. This smells so good. I feel like you can blind by this because I feel like everyone would like this scent. Down to kids, um, mid-age. Grandma now, everybody love this. Oh, this smells good. So those are the two perfumes I got. That's everything that I got from Ulta. I did get some bio oil. I don't know where it is, but it looked like this. I don't know where the new bottle is, but it looked like this. This almost gone. This is a little small bottle. Um, 0.85 fluids ounce. I almost gone, so I just got me another little small bottle. And I actually used this on my cha-cha area when I shave. I put this oil on, and I also rub it on my thighs and everything. And, y'all, this is another product that I've been waiting for it to get back in stock because it's been out of stock for so freaking long. Every time I go to Target, I can't find it. I must went on a good day. I really did because it was a lot of employees there at Target, and they was just stocking everything up. So, I got lucky today. I finally got it. I got this, and they had this. I've been waiting on these products to get back in stock, but I'm so excited. So, I'm going to be using this midday. Okay, so let me show you guys. I use this every morning and every night. On Mondays and Thursdays, I use this. This is very harsh. It is on 10%. 10% benzol. So I only use this on Mondays and Thursdays, two days out of the week. And I only use it at nighttime. Mondays and Thursdays, I use this in the morning time, use this at nighttime. But I've been using my survey. Let me show you guys. It's the face wash that I've been using. I love it. I love it. I really do love it because it controls my oils. But I ended up using Murad. I'm still going to be using this. It's almost going to get like this much left. Once I'm finished with this, I'm going to start using this. And I just use this um, like in the evening. Say like if I'm running errands in the morning time, you know, it's getting hot. So if I start to feel yucky, I just have to wash my face. I have to wash my face. But yeah, these are the uh, products that I use for my face. But so far, everything that I that I use, it have been working. I don't know if it's too much product that I'm using. I hope not. But I just love my facial routine that I'm doing. And I do have some facial oils, oils that I use. Also, after I wash my face, um, I do need to find me a moisturizer. I should have got the CeraVe. It's CeraVe or CeraVe. I think it's CeraVe. I do want the CeraVe moisturizer. So, next time I go to Target, I'm going to pick that up. Because the moisturizers that I was using, they actually gone. I don't know why I didn't get none today, but I still have some oil, so I'm going to be put, throwing the oil on my face. All right, y'all, so I'm just going to chill the rest of the day, catch up on me some YouTube. I just oiled my scalp, get my bunny on. I'm just watching my girl, Jenny. 
Gina on YouTube. If y'all not watching her, go ahead and watch her and subscribe. She do vlogs, very good vlogs. I love her. So we're sitting up watching her and probably about to hop in the shower. Let me show you guys. Yeah, but this Gina, this her channel, Gina Jennings. She makes very good vlogs. So if y'all not subscribed to her, go check her out. She makes very good vlogs. I'm back in the kitchen cooking. Got my chicken over here. Just made some um, baked chicken breast and I just put a little um, gravy in there. And I just got my broccoli steaming and I. And this here is some rice. My boys love rice. So I got that cooking for them. So, yeah, that's what's going to be for dinner. So, yeah, that's dinner. Um, I'm supposed to be getting in the tub, but I want to finish dinner first. Before I hop in the tub, because I don't want to be smelling like food. So, about to do that. Hop in the shower. And, yeah, that's all I'm going to be doing today. I really want to do my toes, but I don't know. Probably not. I'll probably wait till tomorrow. But yeah, I'm about to just go chill, take a bath, um, chill, watch me some YouTube videos or something. Good morning, you guys. Um, yeah, I'm about to eat me some noodles and chicken. Well, it's really not morning. It's like one o'clock. But I've been laying down all freaking day. Um, the boys and my husband, they're going to get their hair cut. So I got me some me time to try to clean up. Um, I really need to clean my closet. I'm just eating me some noodles right now. I had some chicken breast left over. So I just throw them in my noodles. These, these, um, spicy noodles. So this when you throw chicken in, it tends to not be as spicy. So, yeah, I'm about to eat this and then try to clean my closet. I've been thinking about it all freaking morning. I, I just cleaned it like two weeks ago. Now I need to clean it again. So I'm going to do that and probably go through my makeup vanity and my makeup drawers and clean those also. Yeah, so I just left Sam's. It's so freaking hot outside. It don't make no freaking sense. It's just hot as hell. Like, I'm hot, I'm tired, sweat, just every freaking word. I just left Sam's. Had to go get me some paper towels. And I got some groceries in the trunk. Yeah, I really need to get out of the car. Because, oh, excuse me. It's too hot. It's too hot. And my groceries in the trunk. I gotta go in the trunk. But I'm about to um, take these groceries in the house and then I want to try to catch um, bathroom by the works. I'm not going to go crazy in there. I know I said I'm going to go crazy, but I'm really not. Not right now. So I'm trying to rush. Kind of rush into that. I got lots of stuff, a lot of stuff to do. Yeah, I'm about to run in there and just get a couple of things. I'm telling myself I'm only going to get a couple of things. We'll see. So, I'm going to see you guys when I get in that part of this. Alright, you guys. So, I'm leaving at Bath and Body Works. Um, I didn't get a lot of stuff. Let me show you guys when I get home. Because, I don't know. I think I need to try another location. Because a lot of stuff in there I already got. And I don't really want to get the same thing that I already got. I only get two of the sprays and lotion if I really love them like into the night and um Ooh, what is it oh my god champagne toast yeah champagne toast i already got two of those into the night i still have a couple of those so i didn't even see into the night on sale but they did have champagne toast but yeah, I think I need to try another location. Yeah, it's so hot. I'm drinking Gatorade, and I have froze it. I put it in my freezer to, so it can get real slushy right before I left, and it's already watered down. But these Gatorades, the Frosted first, this brand right here, it is so good when it's frozen. Oh, my God. So freaking good. It really wasn't even that crowded in this bathroom. By the way, used to see my aunt said be jumping. I guess every, I'm late. I want to go over to that Ross over there, but I gotta I got pick my daughter up from work, so. I get a rush. But I will be back at Bathroom by the Works tomorrow. I was trying to film in there, but it's 
it ain't crowded like it wasn't a line when i say it wasn't crowded it wasn't a line but it was a lot of people in the store but yeah it wasn't a line i walked straight in even the checkout lines it wasn't even long like i got in the line and i was next so but it was a lot of people you know walking around y'all know the store is already small anyway so yeah I'll go back in there tomorrow. But I'm going to show you guys the sprays that I got. I got mostly sprays. Um, it's two of them that I got. They didn't have the lotion for it. So hopefully when I go to the different... I may go to my mom tomorrow to see what they have. That's, that's what I think I'm going to do. I'll probably go to both of the malls tomorrow and see what they have. I'm back home and I'm about to make me and my boy some pizzas. I'm using this bread here. This is so good for making pizza. And you also can make sandwiches with it. So I'm going to do three of them. I'm already sprayed my pan. I have time to do this. I still have to go pick my daughter up. So yeah, I'm going to do three of them. And I'm going to show you guys what all I put on it. Alright y'all. So I have my pizza here. Put this in the freezer. So this is going to be a basic um, pizza. I had this pizza sauce here, mozzarella cheese. Pepperonis, these the cup pepperonis, and then spinach. So I'm gonna put the sauce on it first. Just spread the sauce all around it. make these pieces all the time. My boys love pizza. What what child don't love pizza? So yeah, just spread this sauce. I, I need a bulb for my stove. It's so dark up under here. So yeah, sauce up all of these spreads. cheese to it and seasoning. I always put this seasoning on my pizza. Just get a bread with some extra flavor. Put cheese all over. seasoning on it. My boys, I'm not going to put spinach on nails. Sometimes they like spinach, sometimes they don't. But they only really like spinach on nails if it's a ton of meat. I'm just going to put pepperoni on nails. 
But I have to have spinach on mine. So I wish I had some pineapple. Sometimes I put pineapples on my pizza. Me some spinach dip also I might show you guys that later how I make my own how I make my spinach dip put this back in the fridge and add pepper on to mine and then my daughter just called me so now I gotta go pick her up she work right down the street though she work at a dentist's office so yeah. So that's all the pepperoni and the cheese. Let me show you guys what it looked like before I put it in the oven. Okay, so this is what the piece is looking like before I put it in the oven. So I'm about to put it in the oven. Run down the street to pick my daughter up, and then I'll show you guys what it look like when I take it out. All right, y'all. So, this is how my pizza came out. These are the boys two pieces. I added some mozzarella on top. Got spinach on it. Then I'm drinking me some lemonade that I got from Dollar Tree. This brand here. I'm not sure how I feel about it, but, yeah, I'm about to eat me some pizza and drink my lemonade. Hey, you guys. So I'm back at home, and I'm just going to show you guys real quick what I got from... Bath and Body Works. Uh, first, I need to show you guys my scent of the day. So, this was my scent of the day. This is what I've been wearing today. My Jimmy Choo. I'm about to spray some more. Even though I'm about to hop in the tub. I'm probably going to put some more on when I get out the tub. But Jimmy Choo, Jimmy Choo smells so freaking good. If you don't have it in your collection, go ahead and get it. It's everything. So, let me just show you guys what I got from Bath and Body Works. I got this strawberry soda, which I was kind of iffy about because I thought it was going to smell kind of like generic, but it actually smelled good. It smells so freaking good. The notes in here are fresh strawberries, bubbly seltzer, I think bubbly seltzer, and crushed ice. These the notes. Can you see? I don't know if you got that, but look at the packaging. Ain't it so cute? I mostly got sprays. Another one thing that I got is um champagne sparkles. This packaging here, this what sold me, but it actually smells good too. This one of the first ones that I spray, and I like it. I'm probably going to put this on when I get out the shower. I don't know, girl. I said I wasn't going to buy no more body creams, but they had a lotion, so I did get the body cream in that. Um, I also got the pink chiffon. I think I got the lotion. Did I get the lotion? Yeah, I got the lotion also to go with this. Smells so freaking good. And then here it has um, sparkling red peach. It has sparkling red pear, jasmine petals, um, flowers, vanilla orchid, and chiffon musk. Smells so freaking good. Then I got Bora Bora. This something. I think that's an oldie, but I, I didn't have it in my collection. So I picked this up. They did not have the lotion or the cream. They just had the spray. So I'll probably go tomorrow to another location. Hopefully I can find the lotion to go with this because this smell like summer baby lit hot girl summer i did get confetti daydream i did have the spray in this but i tried to do a separate transaction to use my coupon to where you get a um free item i think but i thought the spray was 14.50 it had the wrong tag on it actually was 16 like these 15 this ain't 15 but the little prices at the bottom it says 16.50 but you know on the coupon the value have to be 14.50 so i didn't want to go to the trouble i'm going to find another one so i'm just gonna go to a different uh location i ain't want to go get a different scent but i'm gonna go back i ain't feel like it, it was just too much going on so 
confetti day drink. It did smell good. I do need the lotion to go with this. I mean, I need the spray to go with the lotion. Oh my God, it smell like date night. Oh my God, like, this smell different than the spray. I, I didn't sp smell the lotion in the store, but I did smell the spray. I love that. I love it. Another one that I got is, oh, and I did get the lotion to the strawberry soda, one of my favorites. I got Be Enchanted. This this packaging is everything. It got my two favorite colors, pink and purple. Love, love, love it. Be Enchanted. So freaking good. Oh. Yeah, I got to go back to Bath and Body Works. Tomorrow I'm going to a different location. Because most of the stuff they had in there, I already have in my collection. I didn't want to get the same thing. But this is something that I've been looking for for the longest. And I finally got it. My location was always sold out. Confetti cake pot. What, girl? Confetti cake pop. Smells so freaking good. I'm going to get um the spray. I don't know if they have a spray in it. I'm not sure. But in the location that I went to, they did not have a spray. So I did pick up the lotion. When I go tomorrow, hopefully I can find the spray. But these are all the goodies that I got today. I got four lotions and four sprays. Five lotions. Yeah, five lotions and five sprays. Five lotions. Oh, why I can't count. I got four lotions, one body cream, and four sprays. So, yeah, that's all I got from Bath and Body Works today. But, y'all, this, oh, my God, this perfume. I got so many compliments on this, even from guys and women. Yeah, that smells so good. I'm so glad I bought that. That was on my wish list. I'm starting to get stopped up. I believe I'm coming down with a cold. I gotta take me a Benadryl before I go to sleep tonight. But yeah, that's everything that I got from Bath and Body Work. I did do an online purchase also, so I'm waiting on it to come in and I'll show you guys what I got offline. But yeah, I'm about to do my facial. I'm probably going to do wash my face with this and do a facial mask. So Anyway, yeah, I'm about to hop in the shower, do my facial, my mask, and everything. I'm about to end this video here. So don't forget to like, comment your scent of the day down below. Hit the notification bell so you know when I do an upload. And until next time, bye.